What's up guys, Louis Duran here again. Today I'm here to do a video outside. I don't know why, just it's a nice day out, September, it's pretty hot, um, why not? I originally did an unboxing video of this guy, but I wasn't sort of happy the way I was in that video. I was just sort of down and stuff, it's because I had a, a bad day today and, you know, this kind of made my day better and, and after looking at the video, I was just really happy the way I was presenting the figure and stuff and so yeah I did an unboxing video today I wasn't happy about that so I'm just gonna show it off in this video before I show that off let me just show off a few other things that I've got um, this month so this is a drawing my girlfriend made for uh, my one or our one year anniversary she drew me Godzilla 2014 um, our one year anniversary was last week and she made this for me as a gift and she had framed it and everything I didn't know she can draw like this either like she told me she scribbled it all in because, like, she doesn't know how to do the detail. I'm, are you kidding me? This is amazing drawing. Thank you. Just a nice drawing. The thing I'm going to show off here, I'm very proud of. Um, so, earlier this week, I got a, another NECA Shin Godzilla. And I customized it into the Atomic Breath version. And here it is. So, there it is. Um, I customized the uh, NECA Shin Godzilla. I'm so happy the way this turned out. Just, just just, look at it guys, I, th I think I did a pretty good job, but um, yeah, I think I did an amazing job. Uh, you guys can see the tail, I look at it, I kind of added a face there on both sides as well, to make it look like it has a face, you know. I dry brushed some red, you guys can kind of see it in there. Yeah, you guys can kind of see the dry brush, I didn't want to dry brush too much red because that's not how the figure is, like I kind of made the body like more similar to the SH Monster Arts. Um, you guys can kind of tell right there on the chest. This guy is like really, it's like my favorite custom because you know all my other customs are bad. Yeah, so here's my NECA Shin Godzilla custom. I did a whole um, like vlogs on when I was painting it and when I started painting this stuff. If you guys do want to see that vlog, um, comment below and I'll, I'll edit as soon as possible. Let's just put that back here. And the, the thing that I, unbo I unboxed today, um, I was waiting for it for like two weeks. Here's the box. It's the NECA GMK Atomic Blast Godzilla. That's what they call it. Here's the Atomic Breath. The Atomic Breath is a nice translucent blue, which I really like. But here's the figure, guys. Um, to be honest, the figure is very nice. I actually like this figure a lot. I do agree that with some people, it is better than the original GMK Godzilla. First, the paint job on this figure, it's a nice charcoal gray, which is the same, it's its basically not a like a greenish color, it's a nice charcoal gray just like the original GMK Godzilla. Um, the spines, I really love the spines, they're a nice translucent blue. Like, look at that, they're nice, they're nice and blue and they're nice and soft. I just noticed that they're really, like they're nice and soft. The back looks amazing. I really like the way the back looks. Um, the toe, the, the feet. I really like the feet because like this is a nice charcoal gray and it's just original coloration as the GMK Godzilla. Here are the the downers about this figure. First, paint chipping. Um, that is not very nice. As I was unboxing it, there was paint like chipped from the figure like black spots all over my fingers that was not fun look at this there's there's still one right there i just picked that off right now literally right there oh god but um yeah that's i've been looking at my fingers my fingers a lot ever since i touched this guy like this guy has a lot of paint chip which is not nice for a NECA figure like this that's a quality control issue right there just notice this i don't know what this is right here this gray spot Something stuck. Wow, look at that. Nice. Okay, that was not some nice chipped paint there again. Um, yeah, NECA needs to do a better job on that. The back, I kind of agree with some other people, is that the back is sort of sloppy. It's kind of like just painted on there. There's a lot of people having problems with this figure. Like first, the eyes on other figures. Like, um, this kid on Instagram, I forgot his name, his, I know his name is Lucas, or Luke. His eyes are pretty messy, like, one eye is literally nice and white, or a nice bluish white color, like how it's supposed to be with this figure, but the other eye is all small, and it's covered with blue paint, which is not good at all. Um, that's something NECA needs to watch out for. Overall, this figure is pretty nice. 
There's the, the jaw, and there's I noticed that there's um some darker blue paint in this figure, which is interesting. Here's the atomic breath. I'll put the atomic breath in. That's how the atomic breath goes, apparently. I thought like it just you put it in, it will stick in, you know, but apparently not. But um, let me pick up the camera. It's very nice. I like it. Before I end this video here, I'm gonna give a shout out to Coffee. He's a friend of Kaijuzola2001. If you guys do not remember Kaijuzola2001 or do not even know him, um, it's Paco and Simon. Probably you guys are probably familiar with those names. Um, but yeah, he's a friend of Paco's. Um, Coffee does vlogs and stuff like that. I just want to give him a brief shout out because he's been asking me tips on like, oh, how do I get big and stuff like that. I just tell him, you know, keep doing what you're doing and do what you love, you know. He'll make people happy at some point. So go subscribe to Coffee. I'll put his channel in the description below. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Remember to subscribe, like, all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next video.